Welcome to Strandheim, a hardcore Valheim series where I have challenged myself to only live on the water using a beautiful mod called Valheim Raft. Using the Darkheim mod pack, I have made all of the mobs in my playthrough extremely difficult. There will also be no map in this entire playthrough, so good luck to me. And I want you guys to follow me as we try and win the hardest Valheim experience I've ever played. This, my friends, is Strandheim. Please like and subscribe and thank you so much for 250 subscribers. Keep it up. Here we are in a brand new world. Welcome back Celtic Explorers. It's me, Jelly Jam Boy. I'm about to get yeeted into a brand new map and a brand new world with a brand new character. Hello Hugin. What's up buddy? So before we do anything crazy, we need to get a base set up. So this is our plan for today. We'll find the shoreline, build our very first boat base in which we need to live in to survive. I'm mainly using mods from a mod pack called Darkheim. In the top right corner there uh, is a channel of Timo Redbeard. So big shout out to Timo. Thanks for um, getting me involved in this mod pack and, and getting it out there because I'm super excited to use it. The mod pack basically just makes the game really freaking hard. So all of the mobs have elemental damage and all these weird affiliations where they can be like on fire or they can be poisonous or other things and they also have a lot more health and they hit a lot harder as well so they have multiple stars. Like this is a freaking grayling and look He's got one star and he's regenerating, so that means that his health regenerates. But the great thing is that these uh, multiple starred creatures drop a lot more as well, so that's actually really, really handy. Another big ass grayling. Gonna make sure I don't get hit because I've barely any health. I need to just pick stuff up on the way because, oh, make sure he doesn't hit me, the little fecker can't believe it graylings are huge like they're basically great orbs so straight out the bat it's gonna be hard oh we've already got to the edge of the black forest oh good god that board's on fire i don't know if i want to deal with that but i will screw you oh god oh my god oh my god oh lord oh he is extremely strong okay time to Time to jump up. Oh my god! Ah! I'm on 16 health already. <laughs> oh good lord. Get away. That scared them off. Ah! I'm on fire! Before it gets dark and before I get murdered, I need to make it to the water. One of the conditions of this challenge that I'm I put myself into is that I can't get rested on land. Oh my god, elemental necks. Okay, so that clearly opens up into the water. How about over here? This is quite close to the black forest and I actually quite like that. You know, I feel like if I just run around, I'll run into an Ichthyr Vegvisir pretty quick, you know? This is what's gonna happen. We can only build one workbench to build the boat. Aha! Okay, so to build the raft, we just need 20 wood. Okay. Ah! Having such low health is extremely unnerving. Don't die. Get away from me. Get wrecked. Your boy's got a lot of wood. I'm just gonna use these to illuminate. Most important question. Are we able to put a fire down? Yes, we are. Oh, baby, we're in business. This is huge. Where did that go? I do not know. At this stage, I began putting the floor down of our brand new boat base, which is going to be the only thing that I can live on. It's a little bit scary, but I also put the steering wheel of the boat there and just expanded the floor out as much as I could by one block each way. 
This is then the front of the boat and I decided to curve the front to make it look more like a boat because right now it just looks like a big block. Boats typically have a pointier front and kind of a wider base so that's exactly what I went for. I filled in the floor that bit and then I went over to the back and gave it that more kind of blocky caboose. I then started building the walls of the main part of the boat and I decided to give it a little half meter gap between the edge of the boat so I could run around the edge. This would be really useful for getting around the boat and getting up and down because there's a second level to the boat so we need some way of getting up there. So I finished that first bit, filled in the little blanks and next thing you know I had some doors going in the back and the front and a little bit of furniture. I finished off the walls with a half wall which was a little bit finickety at times for some reason but I managed to get it and now at this stage we just put in some front doors and it's nearly ready. I then put in the roof of the main compartment which also acted as the sailing floor so it's actually where I would put the rudder and the mast and everything and so that I could actually sail without any impingements to my vision so I could see everything around me quite nicely and then I just trimmed it all with a nice trimming to make it seem a little bit more shapely like a boat and I gave the back again a little bit of a, a caboose bish bash bosh and now we have a boat all right all right all right time to get some stuff for the base <sighs> oh that went terribly wrong noise it looks like i have a freaking table on my back not a big fan of that i think i need to go murder more of these boar aha Ooh, style Ooh, I want to be blue. Cool. Cooking like a madman right now. I have to look for some flint. And the flint of all things only uh, spawns in one, which is a bit strange. Come here, bucko. Oh. Just caught him by surprise. Hello. Oh my good lord. Four star neck. Wow. Got that sweet neck trophy though. Where the f Oh! A salmon! Gimme that! Gim gimme! Gimme! Oh! Raw fish! This early? Save that for the boss. Flint, flint, wherever you may be. I am the lord of the flint, said he. There is an issue with Valheim Raft and it's to do with spawning. You basically need to build a portal by the main spawn where all the powers are and then a portal to your boat because if you move the boat and you set your spawn point on your bed on the boat it won't work. So you need that. Um, quick fix but we just need to make a portal before we start doing any major moving away from the boat so that will be one of our first things that we do noise now I've got pants as well wow I'm feeling strong got our little shield got our little club oh it's so nice I love it didn't know you could do styles on the first level make a flint spear or just make some arrows yeah I just need a hundred of those bad boys um do I need a hoe to make paths? Yes, I do. Do I need flint knives? Abso-friggin-lutely. Nice. Oh, that worked incredibly well. Doesn't suspect a thing. <laughs> Feet stop frickin' running! Oh, I missed the fecker. Oh, God. Goodbye. Goodbye! Oh my good lord. I freaking love this. Ah! Did it again. Oh good god. Good luck. This is 
has gone really damn well. Oh, good lord. Couldn't hit the deer if it was in front of me. Need to get a bit closer next time. Oh, I have a magic hoe. Say that too many times to get demonetized. Hello, deer. Hello, hello. Oh, I got him. But he's too quick. Okay, calm down. Calm down. I'm not going to hurt you. Yet. Oh, dear lord. Is that how much damage it does? Right, I'm going to have to sneak up on these dudes. Gotta wait for two moments. Let him move his little deer head. And kill! Oh, good lord. That was a good. Quite the craftables from that now, I must say. Great success. Back to boat. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Oh! Oh, good lord! Ah! Oh, I thought maybe the tree would attack him. Ow. Well, he nearly wrecked me there. I think we desperately need a flint. Flint axe. Done. Fur hat? That's so cute. Yes, please. Noble banner garb. Do I have enough for all of this? Oh my goodness! This is amazing. Look at me! I am a noble. I'm a noble man. I don't look like a viking at all. I look like a little cutie. Put one of these bad boys down. Get me some of that sweet, sweet comfort. Oh, perfect. Armors. Can we build that? Deer hide. Let's go and murder some deer. Forty-five feathers, twenty-five eggs. Really? Are we just getting rid of any sort of a grind here? What's going on? Oh, this is legit just stone. So I'm gonna slap this bad boy down. This looks very interesting. And then little crafting. Of course, I want all the little crafting bits. Ooh, this looks so nice. Give me that. Yeah, that lesser spiritual healing potion. That's really nice. I'm going to leave it there for today. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. This is as far as we've gotten. We've managed to make ourselves our little boat. We've managed to get set up. And we have our cute new gear. And I'll see you in the next one. Like and subscribe for more of this amazing new series. If you're still here then you should hit that subscribe button and give us a like. God bless.